situations and inequalities. I want you to write down this problem. An 18-wheel truck stops at a way station before passing over a bridge. The weight limit on the bridge is 65,000 pounds. The cab, or the front of the truck, weighs 20,000 pounds, and the trailer, or the back of the truck, weighs 12,000 pounds when empty. In pounds, how much cargo can the truck carry and still be allowed to cross the bridge? So I'd like you to write this down, and I'd like you to write an inequality that you could use to solve this situation. So when solving these situations, it's often times helpful to pull out the important information and label it. So 65,000 um, pounds is the weight limit for the bridge. So that's our maximum value. Now we know that the cab weighs 20,000 pounds, and then the back of the truck is 12,000 pounds, or the back or the um, trailer. Now we need to know how much cargo the truck can carry, so we're going to let C represent cargo. So you may have done something like this. We know that we're definitely going to have 20,000 pounds for the cab plus 12,000 pounds for the trailer, plus C um, number of pounds for the um, cargo. And we know then that, that that cannot equal more than 65,000 pounds. Now, also it's important to note that it could weigh equal to 65,000 pounds. So the way that I set this up, and you probably did something similar, maybe not exact, but um, we have the cab plus the trailer plus the amount of cargo is less than or equal to 65,000. So when we solve this, we get 20,000 plus 12,000 is 32,000 plus the cargo less than or equal to 65,000. Now we have to subtract 32,000 from both sides. So we're left with the cargo can be less than or equal to 33,000 pounds.